After a four-year voluntary moratorium, NSTAR has resumed using herbicides beneath its transmission and distribution lines. On Thursday, NSTAR senior arborist William Hayes explained the application process. Uh, we're out here with VCS, Vegetation Control Service, our vendor that's doing low-volume foliar herbicide application on pitch pine, which are the conifers out here. They're just targeting those species to reduce the stem density in this distribution right away. So these pitch pines you can see further up the hill here, those are taller growing pitch pines that ultimately in the right of way as they get taller can interfere with the reliability of this line. And so we're controlling at an early successional stage, meaning low grow tree plant fern community. And that's how we maintain our right of way for access and reliability. Through today's using mist blowers, uh, to target the pitch pine. They're getting coverage completely on the plant because of the use of crenite, which is a bud inhibitor, and escort, which translocates through conifers to control them. They're the only two herbicides used in the mix uh, on this application. And as they travel up this right-of-way, they're doing it in a grid-like pattern uh, to control uh, the efficacy and, uh, of what the targets are uh, being targeted. Although opponents of the practice have argued not enough is known about the potential effects of the chemicals, and star officials say their use is safe for public health and the environment. tips because we're using crenite, it's a bud in it, and it has drip control agent in it, and so these folks were here just two minutes ago, three minutes ago, and you can see now you can't, you can feel a little tackiness, but it's, it's not spray to drip off or run off, it's a mist to penetrate the needles, the leaves, and then that will translocate slowly through this plant, and it will take six months or so to do that to get down into the root system to control it. So, you know, even though we we're covering all this plant, you know, you can see obviously poor soils here, um, but there's nothing on there because we didn't we didn't put it on the ground. It's penetrated these needles here.